creating a buttonhole with the Brother GS3700. Make sure the left upper thread tension dial is set to 4. Turn the middle stitch width dial to 5. Turn the right stitch length dial to 0 0.5. Select the button hole stitch by turning the dial to the corresponding number 1. At the back of the GS3700, there is a screw to help adjust the right leg of the button hole. Insert your button at the back of the buttonhole foot and attach it to the machine by snapping it onto the shank. Pull down the buttonhole lever and push it back slightly. Press down on the foot controller until the entire buttonhole is stitched. Lift the buttonhole lever and remove the fabric to reveal the buttonhole. As you can see the right leg, the top stitch, shows a much wider zigzag pattern than the left leg, the bottom stitch. To help even out the zigzag in both legs, make sure to add a stabilizer between your two layers of fabric and turn the screw at the back of your machine to the right, just past the center line, to adjust the right leg stitch length of the buttonhole. As you can see, now both legs of the buttonhole are even. You might have to adjust the screw a little more depending on the type of fabric you use. Thank you for watching and never stop learning. Please like and share our video and subscribe to our channel.